Okay, so player, welcome to the serve. Um, we can't talk about the serve before we talk about the toss. It, this is this is something that is the prelude to the serve itself, because um, you have no serve without a toss. And the the irony is is that most people take the toss very lightly, and I'm here to tell you not to. I'm here to tell you to practice the toss, uh, is and take the toss as seriously as you take the serve, because the toss is what positions the ball. Um, in the correct place, the ideal place to make contact and to develop your serve, a consistent serve. So as a beginner, the only thing that you are thinking about right now is, you know, the coordinating the motion of the serve, uh, making sure that you coordinate the motion of the serve with the correct grip, which is the continental grip, and getting the toss in the correct place at, at, a, at a position that we call one o'clock when you see the stance that Fabrizio is going to have in a moment. Um, getting that toss in as consistent as possible in the ideal position um, to be able to connect with a ball. That's it. So all as a beginner that you are looking to do is put the ball in the same place as many times as humanly possible and, um, and get the ball over the net and inside of a box. So consistency is your number one goal. Accuracy we can develop a little bit later on and of course power after that. But in the moment, let's work on the toss. Um, again, the grip that we use for the serve is uh, the continental grip. And basically, a consistent toss equals a consistent serve. So we really need to, to practice this. Um, what we're going to see now is we're going to see uh, me basically putting Fabrizio into a position to develop a, a we're going to start a drill, a tossing drill. I'm going to drop the butt of that racket down at his slightly open toe um, at the baseline. And what we're going to do is we're going to ask Fabrizio to to lock that elbow and keep that arm as straight as possible. His left shoulder that you see right now, his body is turned sideways because that's the stance that we, we actually do in tennis. He's just gonna practice tossing the ball up in the air, keeping his eyes up on the ball, and that ball should hit the center of those racket strings as many times as possible. And as you can see, the very first time he did it well, it landed in the position of the center of the strings, and then many times after that, he didn't, because the toss is not something that um, can just be, you know, can, a ball just can't go up in the air and be in the ideal position every single time. It takes practice. And a lot of times we take that not serious enough. So I just want to make sure that we take that as serious as possible. Um, and we develop the toss as much as we are about to develop. Um, we're about to develop the, the serve. So, uh, you know, always aim to release and connect with the toss at one, at a one o'clock position and you'll develop a consistent serve, which is everyone's ideal when it comes to one of the toughest shots in tennis known as the serve.